Free game jump jacks. <laughs> hey, let me see your box. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another edition of the Soda Nerds Hot Dish here. Wait, it's not a hot dish. We're going in depth today. We are going big and grand and trying to look at specifically the different costs and things of Pop in the Box versus Marvel Collector Core. So let's first see. If we can download these buttons fast. <laughs> so I've been doing this collector pop in the box thing for about what three three times, three months now? About three months, yeah. We have a couple of these episodes down. So I got another box. And if you watched in the past, I continually get the Harry Potter ones because that's what I selected. I'm so rooting for another Patronus. Yeah, yeah so... No, yeah, Patronus, Patronus. <laughs> and so I don't naturally collect Harry Potters, but I thought, you know what? The Funko Pop in the Box website. It's super easy and laid out, super nice. I was like, I'm gonna go with that because I don't have any of them. So, let's see what we got today. Now, this is not open, so I got tape. Do you have a knife? Yes, I do. Oh, wait, I have a knife. A real man carries a knife. <laughs> Thank you, sir. All right, so, um, I really enjoyed the, the, the boxes that I've been getting. Um, wait! Everybody, right now, comment right now. Are you hoping for Patronus too? <laughs> I want to know. Are you guys with me on this? Well, I'm okay. really hoping he gets another. I'm just I'm looking it off just to kind of hurt him a little bit. Yeah. Anyway, so good. this is this is the box I got. It's not big. It's great. You know it is what it is. So let's take a look. Do you want to see? Oh jeez. <laughs> I feel like we need some opening. If it's a Patronus, I'm so hoping for. <laughs> God dang it, I can't believe it, I can't believe it! Alright, so... <laughs> so this is Lupin. He's a big part of Harry Potter, okay? Lupin is a big part, and this happens to be his Patronus. It looks like a, a fox. I'm gonna... That's I'm awesome. Gonna, I'm gonna pull down all my Patronuses and just stack them up here, because I think that's I all I like take, like I said, I, Like I've said in each one of these, I want them to line them up, take them out of the box, line them up, and then light them up! Light them up. Light them up. Have some nice up. lights. Yeah. You no, know, not fire. Not melting. These, <laughs> these are awesome. I think these They're are really cool. cool. And you know, with Halloween on the corner, these like spirit looking ones exactly. are pretty sweet. So exactly. I'm not upset. It's great. I'll take it. Well, see, that's really cool. I'm glad that he got to open his pop in the box. And I got to show you what I got in the middle. Here. So this is what I got. <laughs> get my mic going off the table. This is my pop in a box, and you guys have seen what I've been opening the last two episodes or whatnot. I've been getting two pops in a box. I have no idea what this is. This is what they sent me. Ben, size doesn't matter, and I hope you know that. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. All right, so I'm curious because I'm going, is this a box inside of the box? Which would be rather disappointing. Is this box inside this box or what? Let's just do a comparison. He's little. I mean, the way they've been shipping lately, I, I don't know, it, it could be. <laughs> I'm hoping <for> something. <laughs> if it's a Patronus, it's Jess. <laughs> I'll take it. But it wouldn't be because it's Marvel, right? What's a beautiful thing about these boxes is these subscriptions you can get what you're asking for, right? Yep. So, I'm hoping for Marvel. I see packing. You don't always know what you're going to get, you know, and that's part of the fun, right? Wow, that's a lot of packaging, that's a box, bro. What? <laughs> intestine, intestine, intestine. Whoa, oh, 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 dude. That's sick. All right, all right, all right, that all right. is sick. All right, so first of all, we'll, we'll start with the Iron exclusive. Heart. Right, Ironheart? Pop in the box, Ironheart. Dang. Check that out. Nice I love that. score, bro. This is the Venomized. So last time you got her, what was that, two boxes ago, you got you got the, Ironheart, the, right? The, yep, Ironheart, the standard Ironheart. This is the Venomized awesome. version of this. I love this. Sweet, dude. I, I have a whole, like, wall shelf of Venomized. I'm so psyched to get this, because I deeply wanted this yeah, one. That's a sick, that's a that's sick That's awesome. Suit. Yeah, that's sweet. They also make a glow-in-the-dark version of this one. If you find that one, you know, hit me up. <laughs> if you find it, just mail it to the sofa. But this is cool. I, this is a first for me. So, in the descriptions, they say once in a while, you know, you can get a pop ride or a larger Funko Pop. 
I also go, well, maybe that was a marketing ploy of marketing down. All right, whatever. I expect <laughs> more of these. Yep. This is really cool. Bam! I got a nice that, six inch <laughs> giant sick. Hulk. That is awesome. That is sick, dude. The Immortal Hulk. What's he holding? The planet oh my on God. fire. <laughs> they also make one of these in glow in the dark too. This is awesome. This right here is roughly about a $25 to $30 pop. So and what's, yeah. what's that sticker on the front? I honestly have no idea. Okay, so you know, PX previews exclusive. This is a comic book company. So you probably wouldn't know, but I actually already have this comic book that goes with this <laughs> I'm gonna have to put it right there. Yeah, right but away. this is this is awesome. I now have the comic book and the pop itself. That is that sweet. is cool. That, that is, is sweet. really cool. I, I mean, all right. This this box here, I get two pops every month, and it's roughly about twenty bucks. Okay. okay? We you know tax, shipping, or whatever. Shipping, yeah. But I have those two pops. When this one here, I know is at least a twenty-five to thirty dollar pop when you buy it in stores. Yep. That's an awesome buy. That's an awesome. And that's box. just a normal. That's just a normal like. That's a normal pop. subscription. Okay. So yeah. I have another. I hope this is Funkos. <laughs> do you want another uh, late do night? Do you have your <laughs> shopping spree? Yeah. Sometimes I have a fireball and I decide to order online. Do you have a knife? Oh, uh, I. Sorry. Yes, I do. Okay. There you go. I really hope it is. This, otherwise, <laughs> this is embarrassing. Okay. Safety first, people. Holy safety. Okay. <laughs> if, it's, if this is Patronus. Oh, please. Please. <laughs> With me. Patronus. Patronus. <laughs> <laughs> so we got a. Show it off. Oh. Another Patronus. And this is, I think this is Hermione Granger. Is that what it says? Hermione. Yeah, uh, no, this is McGonagall. Okay, McGonagall's. Professor McGonagall's cat Patronus, okay? Uh, I also got Igor Kakarov. Okay, hey, so. That's kind of cool. Yeah, Igor, he, he, he's, he is a teacher, professor at a, at another, uh, Wizarding school, big deal, who cares, no big deal. The Funko's pretty sweet. Um, it's nice to finally get something that's not Patronus. Maybe it's me, yep. but if, if Jeff took off his vipers and his hat, I mean, that, that might look about the same. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, actually, that's scary enough. Wow, <laughs> that's awesome. We're not going there. Yeah. All right, so it, it's cool, really cool to get a non-Patronus one, but you know, how, so how, does it, the how does it really make you feel, Jeff, to not know, to know that this is not a Patronus when you were? Yeah, I know. I got so down on myself for a while because this is like this would be my fifth Patronus, I think, or fourth or fifth Patronus, whatever. So to get an actual Harry Potter character is good, and the Patronus, the Patronuses are sweet. Um, so yeah, no, I'm I'm happy with it. It's good. Fun pop in the box. More Patronuses. Just saying. I suppose. He's I got them all. They're like Pokemon to him. Gotta, he has to collect them. Gotta all. cut them off. Collect them all. Yeah, so, awesome. so this is my Harry Potter collection, right? Um, and I actually double ordered. So I ordered a single, ordered a double in the same month, got them all. All right, so you ordered double in a single. So basically about 30 bucks. In yeah. Month, right? Yeah, and then you, you throw in the tax and everything. It's probably another 10 bucks. All right, so next we should take a look at what a collector core box looks like. And now, who, who does the collector cores? Marvel Collector Core Box is done by Amazon. Uh, they used to be done strictly by Funko, but then Funko sold it out to uh, uh, Amazon. And they still get their stuff from Funko, but they're all now kind of like Amazon exclusives, okay. but they're not. They're only okay. sold through Amazon, so you yeah. can only buy these on Amazon. Uh, you can get a subscription, they're bi-monthly, which is cool. So they're about 30 bucks, 30 bucks a month, or 30 bucks bi-monthly. So it's every other month that it would be 30 bucks. And, so it, and it's, gonna, three pops. it's gonna be pops and it's gonna be... Well, let, let's find out, let's take a look, let's open one up. I actually have two to make sure that we show you guys exactly 
the kind of stuff that show up in these. So these yeah. are the latest two. Damn. I've been dying to open these up and I've been saving them for you guys. So, um, first off, I gotta say the packaging. Top Amazon, here. as always, stellar. Nice job. All right, so I think I tear here. <laughs> or tear here. <laughs> Or I just rip the top of it. Oh, there we go. Oh, hey. Oh, so, oh. <laughs> right on, dude. Everybody's awesome favorite Marvel show as we're the going on right now. What if? The what if? I opened this box and the entire Marvel universe opened up right now. <laughs> just saying. All right. So let's pop this box open. So as he's opening this, if you're not watching the What If series on Disney Plus, you absolutely need to. It's a, it's an extremely good opportunity to see kind of different variant stories of our favorite superheroes in the Marvel MCU. I'm excited to see what's in this. I have no idea. No, 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 I, no, no, go for it. Yeah, I know you want to. Okay. I know you want to, come on. All right, so the What If series, I've watched them all. Absolutely fantastic. Depending on the pops that are in here, I may steal one. So I'm gonna just open it up. We'll take a look. Wait. Uh -oh. If there's a Captain Marvel, he gets it. Oh, he's <laughs> just saying that. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Oh, sweet. Okay, okay. What? Right on the top, we got a pin. What we got here? Captain Britain's pin. Ooh, that's tight. Look at that. And then we have a t-shirt. You mean I could be as cool as you and wear <laughs> these nice t-shirts? Mm -hmm. Oh, this is cool. Oh, we have gotta come out here. We'll take a look at that one. Mm. Oh, that is sick. That is sweet. So right here we see Captain Britain. And uh, if you're not familiar, this is not a spoiler because too bad you haven't been watching. Steve Rogers actually does not become Captain America. Instead, what? instead, I'm sorry. Instead, is that Peggy Carter? She turns into Captain Britain. He gets shot, and then uh, what's the Stark dad's name? Tony Stark dad's name. I forget. Oh, uh, Daddy Stark. Daddy Stark creates an Iron Man suit for Steve Rogers, and uh, yeah, it's a pretty sweet episode. Make sure you check it out on Disney Plus. It's fantastic. We're not sponsored by them, but. It's awesome. All right, so in my first impressions, I love how this is kind of like a uh, World War II kind of fighting poster that they would do for the uh, soldiers and stuff that you would have all across, you know, yeah. the walls and stuff. I, I, like it's the, like the, the propaganda kind of, posters, but the, yeah. you know, it's it's that's cool. That, that is, is really cool. Shirt. That is a sweet shirt. It's and she's like that pinup style. I know they have those pinup Funkos. It, it, it's just set up so cool, and she does ride him. He he is like he can fly, so she just jumps on his back, and they go beat up bad guys and Nazis. So it's cool. That is awesome. Right I on. Like that. All right. Next thing in the box I see is a. Does that look familiar hey. to you? Star Lord, right? Star Lord. Right? Mm, not exactly. What do you mean? That's just that, that looks like Star Lord, right? T'Challa, if he ever, you know, in the what if when he becomes Star Lord instead of. Uh, our famous little Star Lord. What kind of forever? Awesome. Okay, so the collector from the What Up series. No, if you guys haven't watched the series, it is it is he is a really kind of BA character. He uh, kind of the mob boss of the universe, if you will. He is, yeah, yeah, that is. That yeah, he's is a jerk. <laughs> he's yeah. a jerk. He gets up. Yeah, just watch it. He's a it's jerk. Really cool. Oh, let's take his last one. This, I'll take it. Is, 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 it, is it Captain? I'll take it. Marvel. I'll take it. It's Captain Marvel. It's awesome, Black Widow. Look at that. Yeah. Post-apocalyptic Black Widow. That is really cool. That is cool. I am a little bummed I didn't go with the... Now I'm curious. <laughs> Because I I've been I've been trying to catch up on a lot of my what ifs, but I have kids and I'm trying to catch up. <coughs> have you seen the yes. apocalypse? Yes, I have. Is that screen accurate? Yeah, yeah, it is. She's she's a badass. That's awesome. Yeah, she is a badass. Yeah, Black Widow. She's always a badass. That's true. Her movie Black she's Widow. She's very BA and everything. So. Yeah, it's fantastic. That's a great. That is a great box. Oh, that is cool. T-shirt, two pops, yep. pin. 
a sticker. Make sure I throw up my t-shirt here. That is sick. I'm right on that. And that cost, how much did that cost you? All right, so basically for the pin, the t-shirt, the sticker, and the two pops, that is 30 bucks. So okay. basically all of that for your three pops that you have. Okay. But well, wait, 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 wait. So when we look at this, we have the obviously two different brands of mystery mm -hmm. boxes. All right, so we have the Motorball Collector Core Box in which you get other things besides just the pops like the t-shirt and the pins and the sticker. But the pop in the boxes, you're strictly just getting pops. And, okay. you, and you can get more than what's available that month, right? So if I do, right. so so the benefit to getting the, the like like this collector core is, you are get you know you're getting Marvel, you know you're getting Deadpool, you know you're getting whatever. Marvel collector core is strictly just the Marvel. They did do a branch off on uh, Justice League and Star Wars for a while. Both of them kind of flopped out because Marvel rules and that's what it is. It does. But, <laughs> just kidding, no hate mail, just kidding, just kidding. <laughs> They, they just did not get the response that they were looking for, uh, as they did with the Marvel team there. So, they pushed on with Marvel Collector Corp boxes, that's why that's the only box left. Now, yes, for $30, that's what you yep. get. So, versus the pop in the boxes, you have three pops. Now, if you're looking strictly just as a pop collector, that might be the route you take. Yep. You also go, hey, these are awesome pops, but I don't know. I, I kind of like the ability of getting that mystery stuff. But does that always come in the same kind of boxes? Right. So I have a second box to open up for you guys, Ooh, just to make sure that this is the kind of stuff that, you know, what comes in the Marvel Collector Four boxes, yes. you know? Was it a fluke that he got that amazing a box? We'll find out. Just showed up on my doorstep just showed today. Up on <laughs> so let's safely pop this, no pun intended, pop this <laughs> box open. All right. I ever tell you a story in which I stabbed a knife into my leg? Yeah, you did. Okay, just make sure. <laughs> Learn from it. Yeah. If you guys didn't hear about it, watching previous episodes. Yeah. Don't get too excited with a knife. I'm being a Captain America show, I'm just saying. That's right. And once again, oh, sweet. Amazon does a great job with their shipping. I gotta be. Good. One of his favorites. <laughs> Shang Chi. That's a nice box. That's the that's sweet, dude. So the, when you get the five collector pieces. corpse, okay, it's got five pieces. You know kind of what you're gonna get. You're getting. A well, five you know, piece. obviously, you're you're going to get. Funkos in here. Yeah. I've had other Funko collect, uh, uh, Collector Core boxes that I've had three pops in there. Um, okay. I've had ones that have no t-shirts, uh, some that have different comic books. In the beginning, they had all sorts of different comic books, which are awesome collectibles, by the way. Um, but I'm curious what's in this box. You know it has five pieces, but you don't know what those five pieces are. Typically anywhere from four to six pieces okay for sure you're gonna get sometimes stickers sometimes not you know sometimes you know and, and that's where i love these for that kind of variety of mystery but i'm always after for the funko pops anyway so let's take a look trusty knife shang chi shang now shang chi right now is one of the most popular marvel movies of 2021 um though i didn't necessarily love it it was a great movie it was great to go see back in the movie theaters to go see this movie. So Absolutely. it was phenomenal. Absolutely. Absolutely. I it was really a great, it. it was a great movie. Oh, I don't know. Oh, sweet. And another shiny, ooh, t-shirt. Shiny t Open that puppy up and see. Okay. <laughs> so right off the bat, I can see something very specific. That's really cool. Um, That's sweet. I like this, this nice t-shirt. Dang, dude. See, this is the kind of stuff I go, where was that when we went and saw the movie? Yeah. <laughs> I wanted that. That's awesome. That is really cool. Sorry, Peggy Carter, I'm covering you up. So you got <laughs> you have the character the main characters in the Ten Rings. You got Shang Chi, his sister, and his girlfriend. You know what? I just watched Iron Man 1. 
and all over that is the ten rings. Watch it. Take a look. Don't miss those little hidden things. We're talking about Iron Man 1 and it had the ten rings already in there. I never noticed it until I watched it last week. Marvel, you silly bugger, you have all those <laughs> Easter eggs. I love you for it! Yeah. <laughs> Makes me keep watching your guys' movies. Yep. Mm -hmm. And rewatch them over and over. But one of my favorite <laughs> characters from the movie we got in the sticker. Bam. The, the little mythical creature that they find. With no head. <laughs> he's sensitive about that inside joke. It's okay. He's... And he's the only one who knows how to get to the magic land. Which I'm very curious how he knows where he's going. <laughs> With no head. He reminds me of Cat Dog. Cat Dog, yes. But the That's opposite. Awesome. <laughs> no, Without head. That is really cool. <laughs> I'm, glad, I'm glad they put something of it. I was hoping for the pop. That would have been cool. That, I hope. Yeah, Funko, well. make it happen. Make this bugger into we a pop. Him to be a pop. Jimmy Crickets, I love this guy. I think that would be he really was, cool. Yeah, he's absolutely <laughs> a cool character, for sure. All right, so what else yes, we got here? What was that? I feel another pin. Marvel Collector Core is very good with the pins, and I actually have grown on those. I, I like that. I like that. Ooh, I like that. Oh, that is sweet. That is sweet. The Guardian, right? Yeah. The Guardian Dragon. That now, is really cool. I like that. Yeah, so the rumor is that that oh, is... That is sweet. What the heck is that dragon's name? God damn, I'm, I'm blanking. But anyways, he's the Guardian. He he ends up being a very pivotal role, actually, in the movie. If you haven't seen it yet, watch it. Shang-Chi is a fantastic movie. However... Do it in theaters, though. Get our theaters back and going. Come on. Get back out there. Are you peeking? I'm, he's, uh, he's peeking. I'm like a kid at Christmas. I want to peep a little bit. I want to see that. No, you can't see that. Oh, it shows what's in the box. You can see, see what's the next one. <laughs> there you go. Oh. <laughs> oh, sweet. Okay, I'll begin the next one. Oh, uh oh. No! Hang on! There it is! It's a there it is. Bam. His sister. Look at that. And it's her, his sister, Fant an excellent character. I like the story the story they have for her because they don't like overplay her. She's a badass, right? Oh, big time. And she's pivotal in the creation of uh, Shang Chi's character as well. So, details pretty good on that. I love the detail. I mean, they have the the dragon going down the pants, the 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 em or uh, yeah emerald yeah. necklace. I love that. That is awesome. No, I'm I'm curious where they're gonna take her into this big mob boss world that she's grown up in. I'm curious where they're taking her. So, uh, are, uh, what do you mean mob boss? I'm just saying. Okay. No spoilers. He's, no spoilers. <laughs> just go see the movie. If you haven't seen it yet, you know you're not a true Marvel Support fan. Support just saying. Your Marvel so, uh, movies. All right. Get out there. Watch the movies, kids. My personal favorite, right off the bat, Thor. <laughs> this is awesome. Look at that. Shang, Shang she, she himself. Yep. Look at that. Does he have the rings? I didn't he see ha Oh, he has the rings on. That is phenomenal. And I personally love his uh, warrior suit. That oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, his suit made from dragon scales, right? Yeah. Yeah. No spoilers. No spoilers. It's not made from dragon scales. <laughs> No, that is that is awesome. He's got the ten rings on. The detail is there. All right, so let's look at these two boxes fully side by side here. All right, I spent twenty dollars for these. Okay, I also spent thirty dollars for this. Now, the pros and cons here. I really love the the mystery factor of going. What's going to be in the box? I have a feeling. Sometimes there's going to be a shirt, sometimes there's not. Sometimes there's going to be a pin, sometimes there's not. I like the mystery of, oh my goodness, what kind of exclusive pops are they going to be putting out directly for this box? But I also like the fact that I love Marvel so much that I go, whatever you're going to send me is awesome because I love Marvel and it is the true mystery. But it's just going to be the pops themselves. 
Uh, some of the things that I like here with Pop the Box is it is every month. So every month you get that box every month. Every month. But with the Marvel Collector Core, it's bi-monthly. So it's kind of like, all right, well, but in each one of them, they come with a card that shows you what's gonna come in there, but what is the up and coming box. And so the Eternals is gonna be the next box that is gonna be coming out, which gets me excited to go, yes, I wanna keep my subscription. Yes, I wanna get my Eternals. That is awesome. I, I keep all of these cards because I think it's kind of a, also a fun little collector to go to. Now granted, Marvel Collector Core is strictly just Marvel. Yeah. You like some of the Harry Potter stuff. Yep. So that wouldn't be your kind of thing. Yeah, yeah. So for me, you know, I started this with just a single pop every month. I just kind of want to start out and see. So as a, as a pretty basic collector, I just want to put my feet in the water, see how it feels. Um, and they, this this month I decided to go with, I'll get the three. Um, and I'm okay with that. Like that's, you know, that it matches my investment interest. You know, I'm like a 20, 30 bucks a month kind of collector. Um, I do like the mystery. I'm not, a, I'm not upset that I got Patronuses, but you know. Now he needs the rest of them. Pop in the box, <laughs> make it happen. Now that I've seen what, what is actually in these boxes, these collector corps, I like it. It's it's a fun collection for 30 bucks, right? 30 mm -hmm. bucks, you're getting a t-shirt, you're getting two pops, you're getting a pin and a sticker. It's a great value. And sometimes you get more, sometimes you get less. It is, and that that's part of the mystery of it all. Yeah, so. but on, on the other side, you know, getting the mystery box, I know I'm requesting a random pop. And so that's kind of cool too. So, I mean, right now I'm looking at your boxes and I'm a little jealous because <laughs> they came with quite a bit. Well, see, I, you know, I I look at this too and go, all right, yes, Marvel Collector Cores are exclusives themselves. I got some pretty cool exclusives yeah. in the pop in the boxes too. So it's kind of like, but that's that's something that and you're not maybe a normal thing, maybe a, a yeah. rare thing. And you're not getting those like in the store, right? I mean, no. those are pretty much exclusives. Well, this These one here exclusives. you can't get in a store. Okay. That one here you can't. This one here you can get in comic book stores and stuff like that. But if they're not already bought out, they're also paying 25, 30 bucks for this when I paid 20 bucks for, the for this. Yep. That's typically not a normal thing. I, d I don't know. I mean, that's that from the other boxes that I've opened, I'm surprised to see this big guy. Both very excited and very happy with that. But I also go, there's other versions too. I mean, this is just Marvel. Yep. There's also, with Pop in the Box, there's also the DC, there's the anime, there's the gamers version. There's more variety over the Marvel Collective Core boxes. Yep. So, I don't know. I mean, for the value of what a Marvel Collector Core box shows, if you like the mystery and kind of the other collectible things, like I do, that's the box you go for. But for Pop in the Box, it's yeah. kind of nice too that I can collect the things that I want to collect and I want it to be a mystery. You know, so yeah. for 10 to 20 bucks a month, I can get random pops and that's cool too. Yeah. Like it, it's, it is. So, I mean, Looking at this, I'm satisfied with both companies. I think they do exactly what they're saying, um, and I'm not. I'm not unhappy. I do love the shirts. Like the shirts are cool, and that's that certainly is an exclusive that I, I think would bait me into wanting to get like the Eternals box next month. It is pretty cool. I know you're gonna get it. So, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so yeah. So uh, we'll see what Harry Potter brings me next month. <laughs> And we'll see what the Eternals bring then <laughs> next month, right? Exactly. Cool. As always, guys, make sure you collect what you want. This is just for your guys' information. You know, hey, we got the seasons of giving coming up. Maybe this might be a great Christmas gift. Maybe this might be a great Christmas gift. Think about what your uh, loved ones like and uh, go from there. But until then, remember, it's fun to be a kid. Even if you aren't one. Thanks a lot, guys. We'll see you later. Stay spooky. Mwah! <laughs> 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 <laughs>